For more than 15 years, farmers have been growing Clearfield rice varieties, a line that is resistant to the herbicide New Path. Clearfield varieties were crucial in overcoming red rice and other weedy rices that are very similar genetically to commercial rice. But over time, these weeds have been showing resistance to New Path, forcing plant breeders to develop a new line. Scientists at the LSU Ag Center H. Rouse Caffey Rice Research Station are introducing the Provisia line of rice they believe will complement Clearfield lines well. The line has good yield potential and I'm going to say exceptional grain quality. It has very little chalk and it has a very long uh, average grain length. Linscom expects the Provisia line to be available to growers next year on a limited basis. It's in seed production with the idea that hopefully in 2018 we should have somewhere between 70 and 90,000 acres of seed available. Having another option for fighting weeds will give farmers the opportunity to alternate between Provisia and Clearfield lines, giving them another tool to combat weeds. Just having another system, another herbicide resistant crop that will allow us to take these weedy rices out while at the same time still having the Clearfield system, what it will do is kind of extend the life of both of the, the technologies. Louisiana has approximately 400,000 acres of rice planted this year, a decrease of more than 8 percent. The crop did suffer some limited damage from Tropical Storm Cindy. It really dinged up a lot of our rice and it, and it blanked a lot of that rice and we have a lot of uh, rice that has a distinctive brown color to it. Uh, some people call this bruising. Harold said the significance of damage will not be known until harvest. With the LSU Ag Center, this is Craig Gotro reporting.